Hey, how you doing? My name is Ben Schwartz, and this is the Late Show Feature Film Faves. My favorite movie of all time, Back to the Future, part one. I love it with my whole heart. Oh my goodness, I probably saw it probably right around the time it came out, and I would have been living in the North Bronx at that time, so I would have seen it in probably a theater in Riverdale. I saw it for the first time when I was a kid, and it kind of made me realize like, oh, this is what a movie is. Brief synopsis of Back to the Future. <laughs> it's gonna sound a little messed up, but we have a young gentleman that is friends with an old, sci <laughs> old scientist. The young gentleman goes back in time, almost kisses his mom. The pitch is, this is a tough pitch. I'm realizing now it's a tough pitch. But the whole idea is he has to save his own family tree by going back and seeing what they were like as kids. And I think it's really fun, the idea of like, if you could hang out with your parents when they were kids, what would that be like? And is that something that you'd want to do? So Marty McFly gets to do exactly like that. And also, I'm a kid at that time. I'm a nerd and, and time travel. And the DeLorean and the Nikes he was wearing. What are you, insane? So it was everything that I wanted. And Michael J. Fox in that role is like, he's like the everyman. And he's kind of like the cool, but also a little bit of a nerd. And it was just perfect for me. You know what's so funny? The most obscure quote that I say from that is, at the end of Back to the Future 1, there's a gentleman who's drunk on a bench. He gets up and he goes, crazy drunk drivers. I'm gonna give that guy a shout out because I probably said that quote more times than I've said 1.21 gigawatts in my life. Wow. How do you add to the Mona Lisa? Is this, Zemeck is asking if I wanna be in Back to the Future part four? Yeah, of course, yes. But also don't make it. But like, is the role open? If the role's open, yeah, of course, I'm tech avail. But like, don't make it. But I'm like, not expensive. I would have so much fun playing Doc Brown, or if there was a prequel, the younger version of Doc Brown would be so fun. I don't think I'd be interested in a prequel unless you play the young Doc Brown. And we got that on tape? <laughs> we can use that, we don't, that's fine, right? We got that audio, great. I have been Ben Schwartz. This is The Late Show's Feature Film Faves. Thank you for having me, and I'll see you at the movies. Or the, the movie has already come out, the one that I talked about, so it wouldn't make sense. I'll see you at, at your home. Now, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be at your home. I'm just saying, like, that's where you would watch Back to the Future now. But if you wanna have me over, we should just cut. We cut? We cut.